Hey guys, so I wanted to come and share with you um, the regimen that I've been using on my hair for the past you know, month or so since I moved and what I normally do. Um, so, like today, it was like wash day for me. And when I say wash day, not the actual clarifying day because I don't actually wash my hair with shampoo every single time. Um, I usually co-wash so I do wear um, the eco styler gel the this is the yeah olive oil one the, um, this is the only one I really ever used and fell in love with because of the consistency of it and because it has the olive oil in it it just seems to do better in my hair especially for me to be applying it on top of each other or keeping it in for long periods of time or the flaking and just having it wash out so I have pretty much stuck with this and actually this is the 32 ounce this lasts me forever and I use this at least on a weekly basis if not sometimes daily so um but I couldn't imagine how long it would take me to go through a five pound and that one I got from Sally's um they usually run me anywhere from 2.99 to maybe $4.99 depending on if they're on sale I don't know um, I don't even think I've paid $4.99 for eco salad before so anyways that's normally what's in the front part of my hair because I wear half wigs and so there's always a headband and a little bit of that in the front to smooth it out um, so I have that in my hair and I had my hair in like some really lazy uh, Nubian or Bantu knots um, I think I had four of them. So I had two here and two here. And they, I mean, lazy, lazy. Like, they weren't even all the way twisted. I just twisted them, didn't detangle, and stuck bobby pins in them. Thinking later on in the week, I would go and, um, you know, what do you call it? Go and do some nails with my hair. And I never did. I didn't wear it to work at all. I wore a half wig all week. So, since I didn't detangle for a good week and... Before that, I hadn't detangled, which is kind of bad. Um, I use this. It's Mane and Tails Detangler. Um, this stuff is the truth, okay? I got this because when I was still, and I'm still on my journey, but when I was still really young in my journey and I would take my braids out, I was like, oh my God, what do I do? And, you know, on days when I didn't want to wear my hair curly, I didn't know how to kind of like detangle it and comb through without really being mean to my hair so one day after taking some braids out or something or something I had in my hair um and I wasn't gonna wear it natural or curly or whatever I was gonna straighten my hair I needed something to help me detangle it so I went to Sally's and the girl told me to use this and I've been using it ever since it gets the knots out on relaxed natural hair curly hair wavy hair you know you had quick weave in whatever it just works so I detangled a little bit with that you know and then I got in the shower and I ran like you know warm to hot water I take really hot showers around all the part that had the um, gel in it so that's why I didn't have to shampoo because just rubbing my fingers through and running the hot water I pretty much can wash out all the gel which is why I love eco styler but I co-washed with this, which probably is something that All Naturals will tell you about and they love. It's by VO5. This one is the Moisture Milks. Um, it's supposed to be two times for two times stronger hair. This is in the Passion Fruit Smoothie with soy milk protein. I got this from the Dollar Tree store. It's an 18 ounce. It's supposed to be 20% more. But, you know, I forgot what size is under this. Maybe it's a 12 ounce. They're a dollar. And they smell like heaven. And they're really, really creamy. So they're good for detangling, they're good for locking moisture in. Sometimes I even deep condition with those. Just leave it in for a little bit longer with a, um, a plastic cap on or something. So, um, and my hair loves it. So I co-washed with that and left that in my hair while I was showering and stuff and then washed it out. Um, plotted, plopped my hair with um, a white t-shirt just to kind of dry the ends. And then I put it in some little clips, you know, just in, on two sides and kind of let it air dry for a while. And then um, I finger detangled this time. I do detangle with this comb a lot. I got this from the Dollar Tree store. Um, 
But since I had kind of been combing through it already when I used the mane and tail and, you know, earlier, I just kind of finger detangled um, a little bit. And then I put two strand twists in my hair. And after that was done, um, I used coconut oil. This is the Whole Foods brand, the 365 Everyday Value Organic Unrefined. Um, virgin coconut oil with medium heat so this is actually the one where you can um, digest it or use it for your hair or whatever it has a lot of different um, uses it says you know it's good for recipes like mayonnaise coconut muffins uh, inspired smoothies um, but you can use it in stir fry and curry you can you can actually eat it it's they say it's good to um, have a tablespoon of coconut oil a day or something like that so um, for lots of different reasons, but I kind of just put that in my hands and rub it through my hair on my scalp a little bit on my twist a little bit and um, That's it. Um, what I'll do now is I'll wear a headband um, in the front and a half wig and You know, I don't even have to gel the front if I don't want to because I can just kind of like Smooth it back and maybe give it more of a little bit of a natural look, but if I want it sleeked um, or slick back or whatever I'll put the eco just on the front part just really like on this very front part of my hair um, maybe that's called the crown <laughs> um, and put my half wig on and go so like right now I'll show you guys really really quick because I actually am getting ready to run out so this is one of my headbands it's just like one of those little you know, headbands like that. So, put it there. This is, I'm doing this without a mirror, so and I kind of can see across into my bathroom, but not really. My combs. So I just take this. And usually, you know, you should wear um, a hair wig, a wig cap, or pin everything together. And I will pull them back sometimes in a ouch, just headband, or with bobby pins but pretty much it would go like this I would tuck everything in and then I'll pull it up like this you know and that's not like A plus perfect but you get the idea and then I just go and then underneath my hair is moisturized and protected and not being bothered and on the outer side I look like I'm ready to go and didn't take me more than a couple seconds like you just saw so that's my kind of routine. <laughs> Hope you have a good one. Bye.